very first like interactive thing I ever did was resurrecting Fenris. Like there was an opportunity in New York. They were doing this big art parade that went down West Broadway and Deitch Projects was hosting it. And I submitted a proposal and they took it. I was like, man, I'm gonna make this happen. I'm actually gonna resurrect Fenris. Like I'm gonna build him the size of a car, big bat wings that move, the jaw moved up and down so you could feed people to him. And I had two drummers on the back that played towards each other's Melvin style as we went down West Broadway. All my friends had the mask that I made, covered in blood, fake fur boots, and just high energy. At the end of the parade, my friends took their mask off, but I looked at their face and they looked like five years younger in the face. And I always say, oh, their inner wolf bat was released, you know, but it, it was really like their inner child was released. Like they were able to put this mask on for a minute, cut loose, drop their ego, be a part of something bigger than themselves, and feel like a sense of security because you're with all these other people. I think it evolved into that. Like I've always loved storytelling. I've always loved folklore. It's almost like the transformation from doing like a 2D piece of work of a wolf, right? And then going, well, fuck, man, I, I work construction. I know how to build stuff. I want the wolf to come off the wall. That aspect has allowed me to bring other people into different projects, which is always really rad.